Even more anger from Republicans over the border. And Tory, Governor Brian Kemp is now sending even more National Guard troops to Texas. He is. And during his press conference today, Blair, he said this is really just back end support that they're going to be providing to Border Patrol agents and Texas law enforcement officials that have been dealing with the migrant issue at the southern border of Mexico. Today, we reinforce our commitment to keeping Georgians safe but also the right of states to defend themselves against threats. Governor Brian Kemp says the Biden administration is failing Georgians by failing to act on stronger immigration policies. And now he's taking his own approach. And we have no choice, no choice but to step in. Therefore, I'm announcing today that in addition to the Georgia Guardsmen already stationed at the border, we will send reinforcements to Texas this spring. Right now, 29 members of Georgia's National Guard are already in Eagle Pass, assisting with surveillance. Governor Kemp says now he's sending 15 to 20 more to set up a command post to help Texas Governor Greg Abbott and law enforcement officials stop thousands of migrants from crossing into the United States. Now we're going to be doing engineering kind of set up type work. So, I mean, we're not... Our National Guard is not going to be going and arresting people. We're trying to free up the Border Patrol to simply do apprehensions and do a lot of that back end work. While Kemp says this is a public safety move to stop illegal drugs, human trafficking and criminals from crossing, Democrat state senators like Jason Estevez say it's a political move, sending the wrong message to migrant communities. The issues at the border should be resolved by Congress. Immigrants uh, typically or generally feel targeted by a lot of the rhetoric and the, and the political rhetoric that is used by folks like the governor. Now, it's important to note that this all comes on the heels of Governor Brian Kemp joining hands with a slew of about 13 other Republican governors that made their way to Eagle Pass last Sunday to stand in solidarity with Texas Governor Greg Abbott. Reporting live from the Capitol tonight, I'm Tori Cooper, Atlanta News First. You can find